hello students in this lecture we will see a problem based on interpolation so in this interpolation we know that we have newton forward interpolation and newton backward interpolation so we will see a question here find y of 1.4 given that x values are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, y values are 10, 26, 58, 112 and 194. So what they have asked y of 1.4 means this is a place of x. So 1.4 is lying between 1 and 2. So therefore 1.4 is under this range only. So range inside the range means it is interpolation and just see when to apply forward value and when to apply forward formula and backward so forward formula so just see here 1 2 3 4 5 so mid value is 3 here so if the asking value is before the mid value then we have to use forward formula and it is coming after the mid value then we have to use backward formula so 1.4 is lying before what here uh, the mid value mid value is 3 before 3 so therefore I can say that so we need to use uh, back uh, in uh, forward formula and uh, for that we need to apply what here forward table first then the formula so let's see the solution and we'll see how to find the table now the solution so table value so as uh, how they have given the values of x we completely will take as it is so here this is x column fine so this is y column so x values i will note it down that is 1 2 3 4 and 5 and y values i will take as 10 26 58 112 194 so this is y0 value this is x0 value and the last values is going to power xn and this is a yn so yn is 194 xn is 5 x0 is 1 and y0 is 10 so these are the basic information so as per the requirement y of 1.4 which is before what here 3 the mid value so i want to use the symbol delta so delta of y so we have to subtract these two subtract means 26 minus 10 so 26 minus 10 is 16 next 58 minus 26 58 minus 26 so we'll get how much here it will be 32 next 112 minus 58 so 112 minus 58 will be 54 then 194 minus 112 so it will be 82 so we got first difference column that is delta of y next similarly we need to go for delta square of y so this 32 minus 16 so 32 minus 16 will be 16 then 54 minus 20 32 so it will be 22 then 82 minus 54 so it will be 28 so we completed the second uh, difference then third difference that is y3 of y 22 minus 16 it will be 6 then 28 minus 22 so it will be 6 so we completed this column also the next delta 4 of y so we subtract 6 minus 6 is 0 so this is y0 value so this is delta of y0 so this value is delta square of y0 so this value is means I will round up this 
this 6 is nothing but delta cube of y naught value and this answer is delta 4 of y naught. So as per the requirement we need to apply forward formula that's why I will take y naught delta of y naught delta square of y naught delta cube of y naught delta 4 of y naught. So now I will write the formula. So Newton by Newton forward interpolation formula the formula is so I will write a formula not with the so on n so up to delta 4 of y naught till that I will write here so which is nothing but y r is equal to y naught plus okay y r is equal to y naught plus r into delta of y naught plus r into r minus 1 divided by 2 factorial delta square of y naught plus r into r minus 1 r minus 2 divided by 3 factorial delta cube of y naught plus so we got the value up to delta 4 of y naught so i will write one more term so plus r r minus 1 r minus 2 r minus 3 whole divided by 4 factorial of delta 4 of y naught fine so we know the value of delta of y naught from the table so y naught value from the table y naught value from the table is it is 10 so delta of y naught it is 16 then delta square of y naught it is again 16 delta cube of y naught it is 6 delta 4 of y naught 0 so 0 means this entire entire thing will become 0 so therefore we will neglect it while writing and what is missing here uh, means what is unknown r so r we need to prepare so we need to find y of 1.4 means this is the place of x which implies the value of x is 1.4 so which will be helpful to find the value of r so let's see what is r now so r is nothing but x minus x naught upon h so x value is 1.4 minus x naught value from the table x naught value is 1 i will show you so x naught value is 1 from the table divided by h you just check here h so these are the x value from uh, x only you have to get the value of h here so 2 minus 1 is 1 3 minus 1 is 1 4 minus 3 is 1 5 minus 4 is 1 so this is so this uh, uh, formula is only useful for equal intervals means the step size is common then only we can apply this formula so here h value is 1 i will write out here and h is also 1 here so therefore i can frame for x here so r here so h is 1 so we'll get the value for 1.4 minus 1 divided by 1 so we'll get what here 0 0.4 so r is 0 0.4 so with the help of all the values so i will recollect the values from the table so from the table from the table I can collect it as y naught value is 10 delta of y naught value is 16 delta square of y naught value is 16 delta cube of y naught value is 6 and delta 4 of y naught is 0 I just collected so now with the help of the formula so in this formula we need to replace all the values so we'll uh, replace one by one just see here so y r means instead of r here so we need to get the value of y of 
so therefore y of 1.4 equal to y not as per the formula you just uh, go through it formula so y not value so y not is 10 plus r value is 0 0.4 into delta of y not it is 16 plus r value is 0 0.4 into r minus 1 that is 0 0.4 minus 1 with reference to the formula i am writing this into 2 divided by 2 factorial 2 factorial is 2 delta square of y naught from the table it is 16 plus next term is r r value is 0 0.4 into r minus 1 that is 0 0.4 minus 1 into r minus 2 0 0.4 minus 2 whole divided by 3 factorial is 6 into delta cube of y naught is 6 plus actually uh, fourth term we can write but delta 4 of y naught is 0 so that's why i will write 0 so this value will uh, type in the calculator directly and we'll see what is the solution here so this completely will type in the calculator that is 10 plus 0 0.4 close the bracket into 16 close the bracket plus so we have fraction here i will use the same fraction so fraction option bracket 0 0.4 bracket 0 0.4 minus 1 and type as it is divided by 2 side cursor into 16 this we have taken the term plus next term will be 0 0.4 or uh, take a fraction bracket 0 0.4 close the bracket bracket 0 0.4 minus 1 close the bracket then 0 0.4 minus 2 close the bracket divided by 6 side cursor then into 6 so once you get these all values we have entered so if you want you can cross check then you press the equal to sign you will get a fraction but i want in the form of uh, decimals so answer is 14.864 so this answer will note it down So, y of 1.4 will be 14.864. So, in this way, we need to get the solution of the given forward problem using Newton forward interpolation formula.